Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'll be sharing with you guys a quick review on the plastic cosmetics. So for those of you guys who didn't know, this is a brand by Xiaxue. Xiaxue is an influencer in Singapore. I believe if you are Singaporean, you should know her. So uh, this is actually from my friend Sarah. And Sarah, if you're watching this, love ya! Again. Love you! Okay, so I'm going to open the lashes really quickly. Look at the packaging, it's so beautiful and it's so sparkly. This is how it looks like inside and this is basically like the instructions. So step 1 to step 5 on how you can actually like use the magnetic lashes. I will quickly do a review on this together on camera with you guys. So in case if you guys didn't know, I've actually done another like magnetic lashes review on my channel before. I'll link it over here, you can go and watch. Of course, this is much more expensive. So back then, I was thinking of like trying out magnetic lashes because I've never tried it before. And I was thinking of getting the plastic cosmetics lashes by Xiaxue initially. But when I saw the price tag, I thought it was like slightly too expensive for me, which is why I decided to buy it somewhere else. So today, I'm going to try this on camera and let you guys know how I feel about it and is it really worth the money. So I will now let you guys know how much does this cost over here. Okay, anyway. So this shirt is from my Taobao haul In case if you guys haven't watched my Taobao haul, I'll also link it over here And all these like cute little clips are also from my Taobao haul So yeah, I'm just going to quickly go through the lashes with you guys This is how it looks like inside with the instructions Which basically like teaches you how to apply the magnetic lashes But since I've already like used it before I mean since I've already tried magnetic lashes before I will not be like following this exactly This is how the lashes look like inside, so beautiful and I believe this is in the design baby if I'm not wrong which is in the more natural design compared to her first launch so I'm just going to quickly draw my eyeliner okay so this is how the tip of the magnetic liner looks like and I hope it's easy to apply because I suck at eyeliner Okay, I'm done drawing the liner using the magnetic eyeliner so I'm just going to quickly apply the lashes Of course, the liner is not perfect I will still try to make it better using my own eyeliner This is how the eyelash looks like with like magnet at the tip So you can actually like trim the lashes according to your own eye shape So if your eyes are not very long, you can definitely like cut to make it shorter so let me just quickly apply this okay done wow the difference okay like, I think it fits my eye shape pretty well I would say one hour later okay done with the lashes wow it looks so dramatic What do you guys think? Okay, so I'm just going to finish up my eyeliner using my own eyeliner and I'll be back real soon Okay, so this is how I look with the magnetic eyelash together with my eyeliner I think it looks slightly more dramatic in the camera compared to like real life I don't know why Like just now when I look into the camera, I mean now even if I look into the camera It doesn't look that dramatic if it makes sense like on camera it just looks like wow my lashes are crazy dramatic no idea why but in real life it's actually not that bad so i guess this is how i'll look for the rest of the day because i'm heading out right now and um so for the review of the lashes i think it's pretty much similar to like the previous magnetic eyelash that i already have just that of course the packaging is like much nicer and i have to mention the magnetic liner so the one that i have which came with like the previous one that i bought it smells like horrible it smells like paint and every time i remove it it is like so difficult to remove but for this it doesn't have like any scent or any awful like smell to it at all as compared to the previous one that i have so that's like a huge plus point so in terms of the removal i'm not too sure yet because i've yet to remove it and i'll probably like let you guys know in the comments down below for the eyelash i believe like it's pretty standard i mean it really depends on like what kind of design that you like and anyway so 
I guess that concludes today's review on Plastic Cosmetics Magnetic Eyelashes. So if you guys have any questions, just comment down below and I'll definitely try my best to help you guys. So that concludes today's video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!